What's happening, friends? Wayne and I are very excited to welcome you to Photobombing. This is a new recurring segment for us where we're going to be photo engraving famous Canadians and showing you our process. Let's get into it. To begin laser processing the great one, we took a high-res photo that we found online and cropped it to fit our sheet size. We then open Edit Bitmap in Corel Draw and Corel Photo Paint opens automatically. We go to Image, Cutout Lab, and increase the size of our cursor and then trace the outline of our subject to separate it from the background. We then fill in color on the inside, adding and removing sections as we go until we have a perfect cutout. We then transfer everything back to Corel Draw and convert it to grayscale. Once in grayscale, we head to Effects, Adjust, Tonal Curve, and increase the contrast between our lights and darks. This is followed by Effects, Sharpen, and Unsharp Mask. Because we know we're going to be engraving our image onto wood, we've sharpened it considerably, as you can see here. Finally, we go to Bitmaps, Mode, Black and White, and choose any conversion method. In this case, we've used Floyd Steinberg. We then added our quote, inserted the signature, as well as a polygonal shape in the background to create greater separation between the text and the image. To engrave the great one, we put a 24 by 12 inch sheet of Trotec plywood into our 80 watt Speedy 300 laser cutter. We've used 100% power and 60% speed to give the wood a nice dark engraving. We then cut our text and logo from Trollay's plastic sheets, removed our 3M adhesive, and glued them onto our plywood. Finally, to give the piece greater sturdiness, we've used a quarter sheet of our 3mm Troglass Glass Look Acrylic, which was kiss cut and then affixed to the rear of our wood. Photo engraving remains one of the most popular and profitable applications for general engravers. We hope this video inspires you to try it out for yourself. Thank you guys so much for watching. We hope you enjoyed this first photobomb segment. There'll be plenty more to come. Be sure to let us know what you thought in the comments down below. Like, subscribe, and we'll see you again next week.